Welcome to Colonia. No, that's not right. Oh, 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 oh. Welcome to Colonia. No, that sounds very Spanish. No, okay. Hold on. One more time. I got it. I got it. Welcome to Colonia. The second home to humanity. The real frontier. The accidental bubble. Oh, sweet Colonia. My new home away from home. And yes, it is I, Captain Spatula, here. And it's been a few months since I landed here in sweet Colonia. It took quite a while for me to get here, and to prevent myself from going space crazy on the next leg of my journey, I had decided to take a much-needed break from my mystery investigations and check out all the things that Colonia had to offer. Things like mining and exploration and more mining and, and scanning things and mining and scanning things while mining. And hey, those bug missions, they're still bugged out here too. Basically everything you can do in the bubble, except with less variety, not as many rare goods, crappier payouts, no factions to rank up with, and frankly not that many people around. Actually, come to think of it, this place is a dump. Maybe I'm just one of those city boys that can't handle not seeing a space bugs and Raven Burger every few blocks, but I've been bored out of my gourd since the Enigma expedition ended. There's no Thargoids here, no Guardians, no Mysteries, no Engineers, no Permits to Unlock, no High-Grade Modules, no Pizza, and worst of all, no easy way back. Now, there was one redeeming thing, though. Well, that Jack guy is one hell of a bartender. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on, hold on. It's good! It's good! Oh my god. Oh, wait, what's, what's that? We're going backwards. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! You gotta get out of here, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. But after a few weeks of hauling scrap for scraps and getting blackout drunk to pass the time, it was finally time to depart. As fun as the journey was here, the next leg was going to be lonely. For I was heading further into the black, alone. Destination, Sagittarius A, on an important mystery investigation. My mission was simple. I was infiltrating a mysterious organization called the Dark Wheel to learn its evil secrets. After receiving a large payout from Tristan Sturgeon for my involvement in saving Christmas, I had been contacted by a low-level Dark Wheel recruiter, eager to gain access to my piggy bank in exchange for membership into one of the oldest cults in human history. But in order to gain their trust, I had been given one simple task. Travel to the mother of black holes at the center of the galaxy, carrying this pack. Shit. The package? Where, where is it? Nova! Have you seen the package I picked up in the Eagle Nebula? No. Have you? Ah, oh, crap. Relax. Think, Spatula. You, you saw it just the other day. What, what were you doing? Wait, that's it. I must have lost in the explosion. Oh no. Wait, Spatula, get a hold of yourself! Okay, that's right, that's right. Every bit of debris from ship exploding gets scooped up and it usually ends up with the local black market dealer. I'll just retrace my steps back to Jacques and everything should be okay. Yeah, that's it. Okay, everything's gonna be fine. Damn, these stations are in need of a good maid. Uh, now where's that black market again? Uh, I think it's through these doors? No, maybe it's these doors. Oh boy, these stations are confusing. <clears throat> Hello, my good man. My name is Commander Spatula, and I'm wondering if, uh, well, a couple nights back, you happened to come across this cargo pod in a salvage hall just outside the station? Hmm, looks vaguely familiar, but I'm afraid my memory these days is rather poor, if you catch my drift. Ah, oh, I gotcha. I, I have the same problem when I drink a lot. No, mate, no. I mean, my memory is rather insolvent. Know what I mean? Oh, my God. I, that's so sad. I, I, I'm sorry, I didn't realize. Oh, go on, buddy. I can see subtlety isn't your strong suit, mate. So let me rephrase that for you. 
you give me some money and my memory miraculously improves and then I'll tell you where your canister is. What? Wait a minute. Are you trying to extort money from me? Am I? Well now, Chief, the answer to that is going to cost you 50 credits. Ugh. Alright, I don't have time to haggle, so screw it. Here's 50 credits. Thank you, mate. Here is your answer. No, heaven forbid, I'm not trying to extort money from you. I'm simply acting as an information broker, with a small service charge. You want to know where your canister is, and I can tell you, for a mere 500 credits. Son of a Duval! I have half a mind to call the laser cops right now! Laser cops? <laughs> Do me a favour. Listen, mate, if you seriously believe Ros has come all the way out of Colonia just to investigate some drunken scoundrel's claim of extortion, then I think you might be even more desperately in need of information than what you realise. So I'll tell you what, I'll give you a freebie. Out here, you see, it's like the old Wild West, isn't it? You can go out and murder old pack skimmers. And no one give a bleeding monkeys, mate. Actually, I'm pretty sure that's already been nerfed. Yeah, mate, but there's no real profit in piracy now anyway. Only pucker trade left these days is information, innit? What, like data missions? Well, not exactly. I mean, see, people want information about all kinds of things. But this ain't no free forum on Galtube, mate. Out here in Colonia, information costs credits. And those what don't have information don't tend to last very long in this savage space what we proudly call our own. Know what I mean? Well, I don't doubt it. If I had known what a dump this place was, I'd have stayed back in the bubble. Well, ain't we all lardy da eh? Dump or not, here you are, mate. And here your canister isn't. So, you want to know where your precious cargo is or not, mate? Fine, I'll pay your damn fee here. Oh, there we go. That's the ticket squire. Lovely jubbly. It's all coming back to me now. I found your canister out there and brought it in just yesterday. And then I sold it that same morning to an intrepid traveller. For fair price, of course. Oh, oh, wait, what, what? Who was the buyer? What's the call sign? Hmm, who was he indeed? However shall we find out, eh? Oh, mother of Halsey, fine. Here. How are you getting it? And lo, my memory returns. He's a bit of an odd geezer, actually. His lips were all flapping about as he talked, like. Called himself the Machine, or something like that. Machine? I know that name. I, I think I met him at the Christmas party. Did he say where he was headed? So, you spent Christmas with a machine, eh? Well, it takes all sorts, I suppose. Not my business, really. Anyway, Squire, I'm trying to recall his last known heading here, but... My memory, well, it seems to have gone a bit liquid again. Know what I mean? Uh, you're drunk? Uh, no, 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 no. Liquid, mate. Liquid. Oh, you're wet. Oh, for my whole sake. Tracking down Machine turned out to be easier than I thought. I had found him admiring a nearby gas giant, with his wing beacon broadcasting his location to all of space. Now, some people choose to live Dangus, Sometimes the Dangus chooses you. Now I just hope he remembered meeting me at the Christmas party and still felt that same spirit of giving. This is Captain Spatula, hailing Commander Machine. No, 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 JK, tell him I'm not here. Uh, Machine, your, your comms are open. Spatula! Hey, matey, how's it going? Oh, uh, uh, going good, buddy. Uh, I wasn't sure you'd remember me after that Christmas party, eh? You mean the one where you spilt your drink all over me? Well, of course I remember you. Especially since we flew out here on the Enigma expedition together. Don't tell me you don't remember what we got up to at Polo Harbour. Uh, Polo? P Polo, yes! I remember now. Wonderful time! Yeah, wonderful time. I especially loved the part when you asked me to wing up with you and then you accidentally shot the base leaving me with a $50,000 bounty and half a hole. Oh, right. That was you? That was you. Look, I'm so sorry. It was Space Madness. I blame Ascorbius. <laughs> nah, no worries. I'm only pulling your leg. I did a few high-paying skimmer missions. Soon paid that bounty off. So, what brings you out here? Well, actually, I was looking for you. You see, yesterday morning, do you remember purchasing a cargo canister from Jacques Station? I'm beaming over an image of it now. 
I do indeed. I bought it in the vintage shop. You know, the one on the lower level. That shop owner. Oh, top bloke. So helpful. He gave me a free map of the area that highlighted all the nearby pristine rings. Oh, and the best thing, he gave me a whopping discount. How wonderful for you. But listen, that canister was originally mine, and it's super important for a very mysterious investigation. Is there uh, any way I can buy that back from you? Oh, I'm afraid not, mate. You see, I ended up giving it away, well, this morning, actually. I don't even know why I bought it in the first place, really. I kind of got carried away with the whole bartering thing. Anyway, no sense bringing cargo out on an exploration mission, is there? So, I, I got shot of it. Wait, 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 you gave it away? To who? Well, you wouldn't believe it. But, before I tell you, that nice shopkeeper, he, he taught me a few things on how it all works out here in Colonia. So, I'm afraid you're going to have to grease my palm a little if you want to find that cargo. Thargoy, damn it! I hate Colonia! Here! Oh, 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 that will do nicely. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Alrighty then. Um, you're not going to like this though. I gave it to a Scorbius. You what? Oh no, it's happening again. Gotta go! Gotta buy! say something to upset him, JK? No, sir. Well, how rude. Finding a Scorbius wasn't as hard as I thought. All I had to do was ask anyone if they've seen a Type 10 roaming about. So after quizzing the locals, it had only cost me 100 grand to find his location. At the Dove Enigma, of all places. Well, hopefully Rog hasn't eaten all those Braben burgers. Yes, this is Philip Ruff. Sorry, Jane, I've got another call coming in. I'll call you later when you're a little less shouty. Ascorbius! Spatula! Hey, it's great to see you, as usual. Hey, new paint job looking great. Paint job? I, I don't have a new paint job. Hang on, what do you want, Spatula? <laughs> no beating around the bush with you, Scorbs. Yeah, listen, a machine said he gave you a cargo canister this morning. Well, it just so happens to be mine, and I was kind of hoping I could get it back. Oh yeah, he gave me this cool new box. It's my new footrest. I suppose it does look a bit like a cargo canister. Wait, you're using it as a footstool? Yeah. Shopping's a nightmare in Colonia. I tried to deck this place out, but I've not been able to find a decent footrest for love and money. Then Machine came along with this one, and it's just the perfect height. I teated too. What a great feature. Alright, alright, I get it. Colonia rules, right? How much do you want for it? One million? Two? No, I, I don't think you understand, Spatcher. I've been on my feet all day. This is the only thing that helps. It's not for sale. But, but Scorbius, do, do you even know what's inside that case? No. Do you? Yeah. Actually, no. But when I get to Sagittarius A, it, it will unlock and reveal the next stage of my mystery. That's why I need it so badly. Please! Oh, all right. Listen, if this thing's that important to you... Oh, but it's such a good footrest. Okay, look. I'll suffer and let you have it. Thank you. For a price. Guns of the Guardians! Oh, all right, what's your price? Ah, uh, it's more of a small request, actually. I just so happen to need some materials. Oh, uh, sure. Well, what do you need? Exactly 50 units of modified embedded firmware. You've got to be kidding me. I know. Just like everything out here, it's so hard to find. Without a good foot rust to keep me comfortable, I just don't think I could get them myself. My feet really are killing me. But if you could take care of this for me, I'll trade. So, I bring you 50 units of modified embedded firmware, and you give me my footstool. I mean, canister, my canister. Yeah. What are friends for? I'll suffer so you don't have to. Oh, oh, and if you could clear my bar tab with Jax too, that'd be great. He runs a cracking pub. Damn, his drinks are expensive. Thanks, Ascorbius. And so, with little alternative, I began my grind. Searching every crevice of Colonia for one of the rarest materials known to mankind would be foolish. 
But with the new material trainers, I could turn bio-waste into slaves, so to speak. So it was just a matter of scooping up as much as I could find and trading myself into victory. <sighs> I thought life in space was going to be fun, filled with adventure and action at every step. I didn't think that getting into the Pilots' Federation was going to consist of me flying around shooting rocks and scooping up the rubble. But I guess I don't really have to do this. I could be a simple trader, or a miner, or, or run a wedding barge and live my life in solo, content only with uh, the size of my swelling retirement package as I sell people their vows. But that's not me. I, I needed to solve the great space mysteries, and that meant getting my cargo back so I could continue my mission, whatever it took. After hours of grinding, I wasn't any closer to the goal. That's when I had an idea. So apparently, if you go to the material trader, apparently you need 7,000 grade 1 materials per grade 5. It's like the damn thing was designed by masochists. But, here's the deal. If you give me 50 modified firmwares, I'll give you something greater than any material that you can find in the galaxy. Go on. My eternal gratitude. Your eternal what? Das kann doch nicht sein Ernst sein. Wir sind doch nicht. Modified firmware number seven. Modified firmware number eight. Only three thousand more rocks to go. I hate Colonia. All right. Uh, oops. Sorry about that, Scorp. Uh, listen. Uh, it took me a while, but I've done it. Fifty modified firmware Enos delivered to your door. Where do you want them, sir? Ah, uh, about that. You didn't get the message, did you? Y hear what? W what message? I'm so sorry. I kind of cocked up. It wasn't modified firmware needed. It was cracked industrial firmware. I've not got any use for modified firmware. <laughs> Why would I want that? <laughs> it's been modified. Cracked industrial firmware is awesome, though. It's got all the benefits of regular industrial firmware with all the DRM stripped out. Give me the canister... Ascorbius. Oh, I'm sorry, mate, but I can't let it go. It's too good. And it makes these cute noises. I'm gonna have to keep it. Call it footy. That's it! I'm gonna murder you now! Ah! Over a stupid footstool? We're mates! What dare? Oh, I already dared. Now prepare your hiney, because I'm gonna boop you! Oh, come on, really? This is my footstool. Bugger off! Give me that stool! I, I, I mean, container! Go away! I'll go away once I get my thingy! What? Ah! Get... Get off! Never! All oh, this turns like a cow! I'm coming, Footy! I, I mean it! I, don't make me... I'm gonna... I'm gonna shoot you in a minute! Don't make me unleash the dacker! <laughs> can't shoot something that's up your ass! Oh. Ah! Come on! Give me a break! Thought we were friends! Friends don't interfere in other mystery investigators' mysteries. Get over here! You, you cannot run, Jerry! He's too fast! Oh, oh, oh god! Oh god, he's too fast! Ah! Stop it! <laughs> hey, don't laugh at me! I'm trying to murder you! Come on! Nova, prepare the limpets. Hey, Scarp, I don't want to kill you, but I am going to have to bust open your back door. So don't fuss about too much. Hatch breakers? Help! Police! I'm being attacked by mad utensil! That's it. Come to daddy. What? Oh, footy! It's mine! No! I can't believe that worked! Oh! Oh, Spatchy, you maniac. Look what you've done to my cargo hatch. Sorry, Scorbs. Invoice me for damages, but I better scram before the fuzz gets here. Thanks for the foot rest. Oh, what a pillock. I was just kidding. Oh, bollocks to it. Who wants a footrest that growls and jumps around anyway? Whoever's in that box is definitely not a happy life form. Nova, set course for Sagittarius A. And uh, send the usual apology template to Ascorbius, Machine, and... Hell, even that shady fellow from Jocks who sounded a lot like that Storpstone fella. But finally, I reacquired my mysterious package. It was time to leave Colonia before the local cops tracked me down. The next stop on my list the center of our galaxy, to complete my mission for the Dark Wheel, and get one step closer to worming my way into their inner circle. But for now, it was goodbye to Colonia. 
and the last reaches of civilization. But as for you, Dangarino, I'm sure I'll see you out there in the black. Stay Dangus. <coughs> yes, Captain Spitla, and we will be waiting for you there. <laughs> Alright, so I'm rolling. Are you rolling? I'm rolling now, recording. Okay. Five, four, three, three two, two. No, you're supposed to go with one. <laughs> you said three. No, but you have to say three at the same time. I did say three. Oh, wait, we have a delay. Oh, fuck yeah, it. Yeah, a delay. <laughs> okay. Never mind. Wait, the station's shooting me. Why is it shooting? Why, is it, why am I being shot? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh no! You're being shot too. Uh, I'm gonna watch out for that. It's garbage. Sorry. 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 To be Paul Yorick, I knew him well. Hey guys, I'm good. You know, we've, you've been asking for Space Legs, we're working on it, and hopefully, we'll have it ready for 2019. Ooh, look at those juicy space sausages! Yeah, I can't wait to take him for a walk. I can't wait to take him to the park. Take him walking in the park. Ah, right. Shane, you okay there, buddy? Hello? What are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? What are you going in the corner? What are you doing with your hand? What are you doing with your hand machine? Oh god. You can turn- Whoa! Whoa! Keep jumping around. Are you, are you okay? Uh, hey, get off me! Ah! Jesus! Machine! What's gotten into you? Stay away! I don't like what- Look at this! Those hands! Get him off me! Oh! Disgusting! What is he gonna do? He's got his hand up his ass! He's got his hand all the way up his ass! <laughs> Alright, okay, what I'll tell you what, do? let's go to a different place. Uh, oh, that actually may have What's done something. I may have done something. <laughs> um, oh, uh, there's a bad oh, thing. Are we shooting, no, are we? No, 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 no. We already sh shot. Now we're being shot. Uh, <laughs> she do something! I don't know. Do something! Something's going wrong! This is terrible! Machine! Tactical Just, systems. Take us out of here! Oh dear. Get out of here, come on! Engage the engine! Oh no! We're dead. No! Oh well. What? what? What's going on? Ooh! Wait, I, what? <laughs> Earth? Whoops! What did we do? <laughs> what did we do? <laughs> We've just killed humanity! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh well. 